in December of 2022, I released to my YouTube channel a video entitled Early Thoughts on Access Football 2023. And in that video, I shared some likes, some dislikes that I found in the game. And I also wanted to try out some of the new features. And afterwards, I decided to take a deeper dive and really dig into the core of this game and put together a video as soon as... <laughs> All right, I didn't do that, all right? I didn't do that at all, I didn't make the video. So I sat and I strategized for months on end, compiling my thoughts and <laughs> I didn't do that either, all right? I mean, if we're being honest here, I've really been stuck playing my heart out on All Pro Football 2K8 and uh, you know, it's, uh, it's going well. Uh, however, I did not wanna leave out my Access Football fans nor detractors so i've decided to put together a video to show off why i love their franchise mode i'm buddy rogers you are you and notification nation without further ado i bring to you five reasons why access football's franchise is winning now mind you this is being done in no particular order and i don't personally rank these higher than the other i'm just really glad that they're in the game yeah you know i mean so coming in for number five for me this one is pretty simple but in a game like this i feel like it's a no brainer now in your franchise mode you have a trading tab and featured on that trading tab is the name and picture of one of your players that player is labeled as your top trade asset knowing that the players on each team are made up this only makes sense i mean you can generate a new team if you want to and you can check out position by position to see who is your best player but it tells you right there and i really like that a lot I'm not gonna hold you about that now don't get me wrong i'm not saying that this is a game that can't survive without it but you know it's it's, it's kind of nice to have that's all i'm saying Number four is one of my favorites and honestly is one of the best parts about this franchise mode. The team draft guide is not only dope, but something I wish I had in a lot of other football games, both old and new. When you scroll over to the team guide, it immediately hits you with the team stats for various categories. You can check out what your team was good at and what they weren't good at. It gives you the areas that you should improve on and shows you the areas where you're excelling. Below that though is where things get interesting because this is what the people want. And then by people, I mean me, I'm the people. And it starts with areas of need not only does this show you your weakest positions it also shows you your oldest positions with an added bonus if your weakest is your oldest and your oldest is your weakest i don't know anymore but you get what i'm saying it shows you who in the player pool can potentially draft to upgrade each position well i mean that's if you're lucky to snatch up a generational talent like nelson nelson stop playing out here man that's a fire name by the way Oh, and uh, did I mention that this all flows into the actual draft? So as the rounds are going on, you can come back and check the team guide, and this will constantly change according to who's drafted and what your needs are. And as an added bonus to an already fire feature in my book, it is the best available. That pretty much speaks for itself and will show you the top three players in the draft pool if your team is good though you won't have to spend time looking at that for too long because uh them players that you see they, they won't be around by the time you draft okay coming in at number three is custom teams and honestly this is a solid addition and one that should not be slept on by any means necessary all right teams on access have up to seven different uniform options that include different helmets several different field types including grass dirt turf colorful turf and even a baseball field you feel me i mean side note okay on the real though i really used to like playing games against miami or oakland in those older nfl games because they played on a baseball field so to see that in 2023 it just gives it a different vibe and one that i welcome because i'm a huge fan of it oh and uh you want logos that's no problem at all access football has a plethora of different options for you to choose from you can make your own team or you can make your own league 
no matter using the tier system or the american style <laughs> nfl and uh i mean you can rebuild any team in the league or your own or others i mean whatever you want to do okay the freedom is yours and the creativity that you can play with is something that's been longed for a long time by bigger titles with higher status and a way bigger budget than this game right here all right coming in at number two is total control after discussing the customization options with you i feel it's only right to let you know if you ain't subscribed, I mean, at this point, that's just crazy. I mean, come on now, people. Come on. Let's, let's be real. All right. Just go ahead. Hit the button. I'm going to wait right here. All right. Mm -hmm. You uh, you done? Okay, good. Probably not. But anyway, one of the things that I love most about Access Football's franchise mode is the ability to watch any game available that week. What? What? Did you hear what I said? I said any game available that week. That means if I got an undefeated team on a warpath headed straight towards me in two weeks out, I can go ahead and check out their stats to see the who's who or who's who, but I can also watch their games in full to see how they perform, okay? Now let's say I'm chilling and you know, I kind of want to play the game, but low-key don't want to play the game, but you know, I really just rather call the plays. Well, you can do that too in coach mode. And while I personally prefer to play the game than, you know, call the plays, the fact that I can do that is another dope option to me and a big reason why I think Access Football's franchise is winning. Coming in at number one is coaching staff. Fam, pull up a chair and let me be clear, this is what I have been waiting for, okay? This is why I buy Access games when they drop new football content you know, some some games think football teams only have two coordinators, offensive, defensive, and a head coach. And uh, let's just be honest, that's that's just not realistic, okay? It's not realistic at all. Really, teams have those that I just named, but what about the other coaches? D-line, O-line, linebacker, DB, quarterback, running back, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, come on now, what are we talking about? And what about a special teams coordinator? Well, people, my people, this game has it all okay those that i mentioned and a few more are available with more to hire as free agents this game in my opinion has the best franchise mode available on consoles as of right now because uh you know we're gonna wait and see what maximum football has to offer you know whenever that releases now while this video doesn't feature any gameplay i've decided to start my own franchise mode in access football and would love it if you join me as we try and put together a franchise that both you and i can uh, be proud of you know a winning one hopefully <laughs> that's all for me man i appreciate you stopping with me and rocking with me i've been buddy rogers you have been you and uh you my man in the whole hundred grand, but uh, hit that subscribe, all right? I'm out.